welcome back to my channel if some of you guys are new here i'm julie i'm 21 years old and this is my booktube almost every single day i'm redoing my bookshelves and my book cart right here but i am running out of room so i had to get a new bookshelf this one is from amazon and it has three cubes so I was going to build it today and then I'm going to put some books in it but I wanted to show you guys the way that I organize my bookshelves. In today's video this is going to be me building a bookshelf by myself. So let's see how this goes. This one has a B on it, so I'm guessing that's important. I guess we'll figure out what that's for. <laughs> okay, I need to go get a screwdriver and a hammer. <laughs> that's what I get for trying to be cute. Okay, that was outfit change number one because I spilled water on myself. All right, so I got the tools that I need. I lost all my energy to build this. I won't give up, so. Oh my God, those wood sides need to be faced against the wall. All right. I didn't expect to be sweating. Cool. This is gonna make a mess on my floor. I should've put my hair out for this. Good. I'm actually sweating. I just realized I'm doing this without my glasses. Wow, good for me. Relax. This is fun. No, it's not. Okay. I should have put music on. What the heck? That was me checking the time. 19 minutes. Basically 20. That's not bad. Because I took a break downstairs to go get the tools. Look at this. Wow. Okay. Obviously, I'm not leaving it like that. There's the last part to it, which is this. But like, this is like a guessing game. There's no holes for it. That sucks. This might be a little hard with nails. My brother's gonna get so mad at me. I didn't think this through. All right. I'm gonna have to take this downstairs and finish it down there and then film the rest up here all right i'll see you soon 
I was so confident, like, did this all by myself, and then look what I just did. So obviously, this part, the white, was supposed to be the other way around, so that this ugliness is not facing me. But, I mean, it's hammered in, so what do I do? There's literally nothing to do. I'm so mad at myself. What do I even do? Like, w wait, the back of this takes out, oh no. No, I think I'm, I'm just stupid and screwed. I'm so upset. Had it so good. Had it so good. I really can't figure out what I should do. Like, obviously, books will cover it anyway. But, like, it's so ugly. And it could have been white instead. You win some, you lose some, right? Well... <laughs> Now the energy is shifted. The vibes are low right now, but I don't think I have another choice. This is what we're gonna have to work with. I'll just have to put books. Horizontally. So that they cover this ugliness. It's so bad. All right, well, whatever, we have to work with it. So let's see what we can do. Now we have to figure out which books should go in here that can cover this. Sophie's books are big, so let's try hers first. These beautiful covers, oh my god. This is the Kingmaker series, which I haven't read yet, but I'm thinking of doing a video where I read these books for an entire week, and hopefully I can finish them. They're kind of hefty, but... Let's see. Pretty. These are the first four. There's two more that she hasn't come out with the discrete covers yet. Aw, perfect. My little Sophie Lark cube. Which book should I even put in here? Should I make this all white, all white books? This ruins the whole vibe, ruin the whole video. <laughs> that looks kind of cute. What else do I put in here? Like, this isn't white. Oh my god. How does that look? Kind of cute. All right. I'm trying to find more books to put in here. All right. I'm taking my Anna Huang collection. And maybe I'll put it in here. Should I put the Dirty Air series in here? Like I'm trying to think of series that I can put in here so that they're all together. Let me move this down. Now look at my book cart. It's a mess. Great. Hey, that fits. That looks good. We're going to do that. I need something to fill here. Huh. I have an idea. Since they're skinny and tall, just like that book, it's Dirty Headlines and Vicious by LJ Shen. So I think those will fit good there. 
up. We'll see. Look at that. I knew it'd fit. Okay, this is my bookshelf, my new bookshelf now. This did not go how I expected it to go, but I made it work. I'm going to put it next to that shelf over there, so I'll show you guys when it's finished. So I moved it in its spot that it's going to be in my room, and this is how it turned out. There's still more to be done because now my book cart is a disaster, but I figured we can go through that together also and reorganize it. Maybe I'll do it by color. This was the bookshelf that I put together and didn't turn out too bad. You can't really see the back, so we're gonna act like that didn't happen. It looks good, I'm happy. Now I can't really open my door, but it's fine. So now we have this to work with. This is my book cart that I organize every single day. It's probably different every week, multiple times a week. So I'm going to try to do this bookshelf in color order. These are hardcover books. These are the only two hardcover books that I have. It's The Do-Over and Malibu Rising. And they just don't fit on my bookshelves. So I was like, you know what? I have to put them in my book cart. So we'll try to fit them in here. Oh my God, no. No. How'd that happen? Oh, that's really sad. Oh, things are not going my way today. Let's do the top two first. And I'm thinking I want to put pink at the top. <laughs> okay. Why do I want to put purple up here? Okay, no, we're not going to do that. <laughs> okay. There's a lot of blue books over here, but we have to put metal blue rising first. Because that's a big one. Let's do that there. Oh, icebreaker. I feel like I have to. It sucks because not all these books are the same height. We're working with what we got here. Pretty. Now where should these go? I'm going to fit them here. I think maybe there. They are blue, but the spines aren't blue. But I still consider them blue. That looks pretty though, kind of. I have all books over here on the floor where you guys can't even see them. Let me try to turn the camera, yeah. Those are going to stay back here because they're either very thick books or very tall books. So they work best if they're back here. Because there's so much room back here, that's why I had two rows on each. But now that I have the new bookshelf, I split them up. But now <laughs> I'm confused on what to do. Why is this so difficult? Like a green book, where are you gonna go? <laughs> it's gonna have to go there. Okay, 
whatever. This is what we're working with and this is how it's going to stay until I heat it and redo it probably tomorrow. But that's it for right now. Okay, so that is it for today. I know this video was a little chaotic and did not go as planned, but I have my new bookshelf up and redid my book cart. And yeah, that was it. So thank you so much for watching. I posted a questionnaire on my Instagram earlier and asked you guys what videos you want to see and so many people replied. So that was awesome because I always want to hear what you guys want to see. So I will go through them and see what video I should do for next time. But this was building my bookshelf with me today and redoing my book cart. So thank you guys again for watching and I will see you next time.